Good evening. I'm Eric James, and I'm from Field Ready. I'm going to start by telling you a story in Nepal. Several years ago, there was massive flooding. Tens of thousands of families were affected. To stay healthy, every family needed a bucket. Unfortunately, those buckets are made in only one place on the planet, Pakistan. They are shipped to the UK, and then onward to Dubai, and then the last final mile is a long, expensive, slow supply chain. Families didn't get those buckets. Now, this problem doesn't just affect WASH, it affects health and all the things that health professionals need. It affects shelter and NFIs. In fact, it affects every sector that we work in, either, even things like search and rescue, energy, and so on. Supply chains are a big, big problem. In fact, most funding and aid goes to this problem. Okay. At Field Ready, we are coming up with a big, bold vision to transform this situation. We're doing this by local manufacturing. Okay. Because we believe by making things locally, we can really make the world a better place. The impact of this is huge. We can, on average, reduce costs by half. We can transform procurement from uh, weeks and months to hours and days, and we can even support local businesses and uh, livelihoods in the process. Ultimately, however, we can save lives, we can reduce human suffering, and we can build resilience in the process. Let me give you a few examples in health. This boy, this is my son, a few years ago. Now, he has a, a nice, fresh umbilical cord clamp. Every, every child should benefit from this. However, in Haiti, they didn't have this luxury, okay? We found out that they were using old shoelaces and things that caused sepsis. What a simple solution. We made umbilical cord clamps locally. And in fact, we can make all sorts of things in the health sector. We can repair, repair expensive equipment. We can put things back in the hands of medical professionals that they need. Livelihoods. Very quick story. This is Mr. KC, an inventor in Nepal. He had a vision for a new cook stove top. All sorts of problems come out of that. We helped him design a new kind of stove, helped him make this piece, the first 5,000 pieces, and now he has a viable business with over 200,000 orders. We're doing this kind of work in other places like Iraq where we support maker spaces for youth employment. Wash, quick picture. On the left you see an existing leaky water pipe, and on the right you see what we uh, what our replacement for that. Where did we make it? Right in the field. Soap can be made using uh, new designs that kids create themselves. And in Iraq, we found that this method increased hand washing by fourfold, a big difference. We're also working in mass production, latrine slabs, and we're finally starting to make those buckets in Fiji. We have a great set of partners, but we need more. And what we, What's most important is what people are experiencing in the field. We're looking for an investment of $500,000 to support our mass production and an 800,000 donation to support our work in Syria. Thank you. This is Field Ready and this is the future of aid.